Hello, this is Thomas. Today I'm going to show you the usage of the test resources module in ALM. Test resources module is the central place to store test data in ALM, which can be used by many test cases. So you see here a customer data table, for example. It's, as you, if you look uh, at the result, it has some requested blah blah completed. So this is not correct. I'm uploading now a new version of it. So now if you take a look now at the result column, it says requested edition completed, which is be correct for uh, this example in my test case. So I'm just uh, created a data table and you can here see there is a dependency tab which shows where the data is used, means in which test cases it's using when adding customers, when using modifying customers, etc. And these IDs are actually links to this test case. So you can click on it, it goes automatically to the test plan and there you can see also the test script. It's a UFT script, which I did save to ALM. And um, you can also see the data table here. And <clears throat> so that's the original one. And you can see the test configurations I have defined. The test configurations um, allows you to run the same test with different test data. It can also use like filters to search for some uh, criteria, to search for some test data in your data table and just select maybe the negative tests and some uh, others are positive tests in this example or any, any other filter criteria you like. By defining this um, link here, you can uh, yeah, you define where, where the data table is and you can easily also navigate back. So if you're on the test, you can just go to the test resource uh, by, by clicking on the link and then you, it opens up the, the data table in the test resources module so you can really easily navigate back and forth. So let's go to the test lab and uh, you see here my recent run. It has uh, failed because the test data was not correct but I did uh, upload a newer version of the test data and so all tests that are using this test data will now run fine again. And let's see if also this one is running. I'm now using here a terminal emulator and UFT uh, entering this test data coming from the central test data table in ALM and typing it into my application under test, which is here in this example, a mainframe application. So test passed um, means I have corrected my test data fine and everything is running. You can see the detailed test report here. It's uh, showing the two verifications I have in here and it's checking in both cases for requested edition completed. So everything fine. Thank mm -hmm. you.